How is everybody doing today? My name is Mr. Zero, and welcome back to another reaction video. This time we're reacting to 500 million, but not a single one more by Rational Animations. All right, so I'm really, really just invested in this series, or this channel, rather, man. It's just really, really awesome stuff. Like, and I only reacted to one video from this channel, dude. It's just really, really something special. And, like, the first one really, really made me think, like, about everything, like, the existence of all so like i'm really really excited to see what this one has in store for it and like i really hope it's like in the same vein of that like it's a video that makes me like ponder and question stuff like i don't care what it is as long as like i have that feeling of like just trying to ask questions you know in this video like unlocking something in me so it should be really really exciting man and so i'm just really excited so without any further ado here is 500 million but not a single one more 500 million but not a single one more Got it. We will never know their names. So I'm assuming this one is going to be like a short story as well. Recorded, for there was no written I'm sorry? To record it. Oh. They were someone's daughter. Already son, invested. And someone's friend. Okay. And they were loved by those around them. And they were in pain. Oh, covered okay. In rashes, Just jump to that. Scared. Why? Not knowing why this was happening to them. Or Thank what you. they could do about it. Victims of a mad oh, Jesus Christ. God. There was nothing to be done. It's about a Humanity god as well. Was not strong enough, not aware enough. Not this is like Scarecrow's fear toxin, to dude. Against a monster that could not be seen. It was in ancient Egypt, where it attacked slave and pharaoh alike. Oh man! In Rome, it effortlessly decimated armies. I love this art style, by the Syria. way, man. It's it a black and white, Moscow. but you have a red showing. In India, five million dead. It killed a thousand Europeans every day. In you the sure this century. isn't like a freaking zombie it killed movie? More than fifty million Native Americans. Good God! From the Peloponnesian War to the Civil War, but just everyone. More soldiers and civilians than any weapon, any soldier, any army. Not that this stopped the most foolish and empty souls from attempting to harness the demon as a weapon against their enemies. I was literally about to say, Cultures man, disease. And, faulted, and it remained. Empires Stupid rose white and people. fell. <laughs> And it thrived. I know that makes me a hypocrite, but I'll care, dude. Waned, but it did not care. Kill. Yeah. Maim. Oh. Spread. An ancient That's one thing about disease, man. It does not care who or what you could are. Could not be fought. Could not be confronted. Could not even be comprehended. Not the Remind only of a gorilla. one of kind. But the most devastating. Dude. For a long time, there was no hope. Only the bitter, hollow endurance of survivors. God, this visualization of the series, man. It's like, it's simple, but it really works for what it's doing. It was observed that survivors of the Mad God's curse would never be touched again. They had taken a portion of that power into themselves oh. and were so protected from it. Let's go. Not only that, but this power could be shared by consuming a remnant of the wounds. Okay, so there, there is price, hope. For you could not take the God's power without first defeating it, but a smaller battle on humanity's terms. Okay. By the 16th century, the technique spread to India, then across Asia, the Ottoman Empire, and in the 18th century, Europe. All right. In 1796, a is this like the first documented vaccine? An idea began to take hold. Perhaps the ancient god could be killed. A whisper became a voice. You a could make a god bleed, a call. then people stop believing in a it. A call became right, a Thanos? battle cry, sweeping across villages, cities, nations. Humanity began to a revolution, spreading the protective power across the globe, dispatching masters about, like, of the craft a god, to protect though, whole dude. populations. People who had once been sworn enemies joined in a common cause for this well, one. Battle. Yeah, governments mandated if you didn't, you'd be that all citizens stupid. protect themselves. For giving the ancient enemy a single life would put millions in danger. Yeah, and inch by inch, humanity take it back. drove its enemy back. Let's go. Fewer friends wept. Fewer neighbors were crippled. Fewer parents had to bury their children. Great! At the I'm dawn of the 20th butt, century, though. for the first time, humanity banished the enemy from entire regions of the world. All right. Humanity faltered many times in its efforts, but there were individuals. I was going to say obviously the cold up, first. Who fought for the dream of a world where no child or loved one would ever fear the demon ever again. Oh, they have like Victor shots and Stanov, stuff. That's awesome. Who called for humanity to unite in a final push against the demon? Let's the go. Great tactician Karl Rashka, who conceived of a strategy to annihilate the enemy. Donald Henderson, who led the efforts. In go those the final music days. swelling and like the, the enemy grew actual weaker. historical Millions people, you know. Thousands. Thousands became dozens. 
And then, when the enemy did strike, oh. scores of humans came all forth right. to the fight, protecting all those who were in danger. You mess with all of us! The enemy's last the first attack in the wild was on Ali Mau Malin oh. in 1977. For months afterwards, dedicated humans swept the surrounding area, seeking out any last desperate hiding place where the enemy might yet remain. It's like, we will fight they you. They found none. On December 9th, 1979, Humanity declared victory. This one evil, the horror from beyond memory, the monster that took 500 million people from this world, was destroyed. Not a single one more. You are a member I get it now. Of the That's amazing, that dude. That. Oh. Never forget. Make me feel like a superhero. When we band together and declare battle on what is broken in the world. Hell yeah, man. I'm all about that. Come together. We can accomplish great things. Yeah, I love this. Oh my god, I love this channel so much, man. It really sparks every single one of my interests, like straight up. Like, it's so good. All right, man, that's so freaking awesome how you have, like, uh, it's like a mixture between, like, nonfiction and fiction, you know? It's like, this did happen, like, I'm assuming, like, a lot of stuff. I'm not really that big into that much history, like, the mute details of it, but, like, I'm assuming this is like the uh, virus that happened like a long time ago, you know, it gave me the actual date, but I'm terrible with numbers and names, but like, it's just like, you have that going on, but then you have this like, overview of like, you create it, like, you don't actually say the word virus or like anything like that, like you say it was a malevolent god, like that strike trying to kill humanity and stuff like that and like humanity itself band together to defeat that god you know like it's really really cool having that aspect of it like the fictional side of it and i'm putting a lot of quotations <laughs> what i say because this is like my representation of what i saw you know it's just i don't know it's just really really cool having that and then like you have the fictional aspect of it like i said but then you also have like the fact aspect of it like these actual people like he said their names you know like the actual people that were involved in this like getting it going and like preventing humanity from like ceasing to exist entirely you know like it's just so freaking awesome having that dude it's just i don't know as a whole like this video is really really something special it really speak to me I'm, I'm not gonna lie not as much as the first one but like it's still really really cool it had that like same feel as the first one but like bottled into like a a, a virus like a like a small smaller thing to talk about you know rather than like the entirety of humanity this one was a virus it was the subject of the story and like overall fantastic man i cannot get enough of this so you bet i'm gonna react to more of these so thank you everybody so much for watching leave a like down below subscribe ring the bell become a member you get videos daily and check out the merch so with that said i've been master zero you guys have been fantastic and i'll see y'all in the next episode later days.